Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to be showing off my Genshin account so far. And... Yeah, so I've been playing... I've been playing since about... Um... 2021. The start of 2021. And I only played for about a month. And... Like a month or two, and then I stopped. But I recently got back into it. Um, either around 2.6 or 2.7, I can't remember. That was when I echo was in the banner. Um, so I'm just going to be showing off my account and where I am and all that. Um, so, yeah. So, if we look here, um, I'm Adventure Rank 55. And my world level is 7, and that's because um, I decreased it, just because I kind of wanted to be a, a tiny bit easier. So, um, yeah. And I'll show off. I guess only reading my characters, their artifacts and stuff. So... Here's Ayaka, and she was my she was my first five star I've gotten, and I got her quite early on. Actually, I remember it might have been maybe like pity forty or something. And please don't like make fun of my builds. I'm not good at building, and artifacts stress me out. So she's level seventy so far. Um, and she's got this sword, I, I don't want to pronounce it, but I think it's really cool looking, and it took a while to get, and I have a primary rank 1 on it, and it's all surfy, so yeah. And then for artifacts, she has 4 piece blizzard strayer. And I'm pretty sure the goblet is, yeah, the goblet's quite a damage bonus. So, she's got great damage in this, just attack, HP. So, yeah. I mean, she's pretty good, I think. I think she's good in my eyes. Um, if you want to look at these stats, I suppose you can. As you can see, the crit rate is not great. But, yeah. Um, C0, I don't have any constellations for any 5 stars. Um, her talents, I I should probably level them up a bit more. But I'm focusing on these two, because these two are, I really like. Especially her Q, her Q does a lot of damage. Or her elemental burst. Yeah. I oh, don't mind that. That's because I play... Genshin on GeForce Now, which basically is like you're streaming the game, and I find it better just because I have it on my computer, and it runs well and stuff, but the loading times take forever, and the loading times are really fast here, so that's why I use GeForce Now, and also, it's I think it's good because there is, like, it gives you an hour to play, and I think that's enough for me, and it like restricts me from like, I guess, playing for longer I suppose, like obviously you can start it up again and play for another hour, but you have to, you know, wait for people ahead of you. So I think it's good because it restricts me to only play around one or two hours a day, so yeah. Next up we have Yoinya, and I really like her, and I think she's good. You can have a look at the stats here, but... She can do like maybe like 8k damage sometimes and I get so surprised because <laughs> that's a lot of damage to me. So she's got the rust um, and level 70 and I really like this bow. It's really cool. And I could get it to refinement rank 2 but Tartaglia is coming back and I want to give him a rust as well so I'm not going to refine it. And for artifact, she has a four-piece Shimanawa and um, a pyro damage goblet. 
and these are fully like leveled up because I'm kind of saving up resources and also it is quite expensive to level these up and I'm also worried I might get a better artifact and then I have to replace it so and yeah and no conservation there and some random leveled up ones nothing too crazy I'm kind of like I don't really have a lot of like these talent up talent level up materials I don't have really a lot of them also like these first couple of characters are gonna have French about 10 except Bennett so here's Bennett oh. um, he's not fully leveled up to level 80 and that's because I'm saving up on these because I want to, as I said, I want to wish for Tartaglia. So I'm going to use these to level him up. I really should do ley lines. All these, all these are from like the story. So he's got level 70 for Polia Sword at rank, we're rank 2. And I think that's good. He has 4 piece, 5 piece noblesse. Does he have a nice HP? Hmm. Maybe I'll change that for Pyro bonus, but I don't know if he needs it. Maybe he does. Um, he's C2, and he has level 6 on his Elemental Burst. Because that move is good. And then here's Kazuha. He's my favorite character. I love him so much. And... Yes, so he is level 80, he's my main. He's got a level 80 Iron Sting a refinement rank 2. He is f um, a 5 piece Virtus and Venera. And I got lucky because this has animal damage bonus on it, which is good. And I guess I could upgrade all these to level 5, but I think these are pretty good artifacts. I like this one because it has a lot of energy recharge and 10% crit damage. This is 13% crit damage. And they all have around like, a bit of energy recharge and stuff, which is good. And C0. And here I have both his E and his Q at level 6 because I love both of these. Especially this move, I just love doing this. <laughs> Um, I need to do as the half to level these up. So, that's going to be fun. Um, I don't know how much of the characters I'm going to go over. But, yeah, probably not the ones at the end, because, like, I obviously haven't leveled them up at all. Or I haven't, like, built them. So, yeah. Also, Kazuha is my second 5 star. So then we have Fisho, and she used to be a part of my team. She's got the compound bow, and that's because she did have Fofonius bow. But I switched Fofonius bow up for Kale. Even though Kale is in that build, and to be honest, Fisho. I love Fisho, but like, I kind of ruined her so much. Like, all her artifacts, I just kind of took away her artifacts because I needed them for other people. So I feel bad. So anyway, she's C2. She's got level 5 on her her E and her Q is level 3. And I really do feel bad. I'm going to build her sometime. But not it's not the time. Anyway, Yanfei. I love Yanfei. And she was my strongest character on my team until I got rid of her for Bennett because I needed a healer. And she's a bit outdated now, not outdated, but she's a bit behind now, but before she was like my main powerhouse. And she had good stuff here. Um, yeah. She's C1. And she has level 4 in her just normal attack. So I probably will start building her again. But I'm already building too many characters. So here's Albedo, and I really like Albedo. Um, I have the video of me getting him. I was very happy. 
so he is. <laughs> I forgot. He is <laughs> over 5 in rank 4. Um, level 90 Harpinger of Dawn. <laughs> Which it's honestly. Can I refine it again, I wonder? No. Hmm. Anyway, it's kind of weird looking at it being level 90 because I've just never seen a weapon that high level before. And it's almost refinement rank 5, which is really cool. But anyway, I think this helps him. His artifacts I'm trying to get, but he has husk. Um, I think this is kind of good. I'm probably going to have to get more of these, but the problem is... Um, I don't like the domain <laughs> that you get these from, because I don't like the rift wolves. So, he's got talent level 4, both his E and his Q, and yeah, that's really about it. So we have Chi Chi, and she was, I think, my third, my third 5 star. And... I... I thought I used her a bit, but apparently I didn't because she's not even level 2 on friendship level. But I use her a bit in the Spiral Abyss even though she's not too built. She's got Kazuha's sword and I'm not sure if that's good for her, but I think it looks, I guess, a bit cool. And she has Blizzard Strayer stuff like... This is getting to like the part where the characters aren't fully built and that's either because I'm, I'm building them or I'm not bothered. And she's got level 4, E, level 2, Q. And I have no constellations for her. So then I got Tainari, which is my most recent 5 star. And I'm really happy because I got him on Nilo's banner. And I didn't really want Nilo, like I wouldn't mind getting her. But I'm happy I got him because I like Tainari and that also means I'm guaranteed to attack yeah. So that's very exciting. He's got Refiner Rank 3 Stringers. I should really... Oh my god, I'm so close. I don't... Okay, I don't really like using starters to buy things, but like we're gonna do it now just because we're that close. Hurry. A faster way of doing this. Okay, this video will be quite long, so I'm going to speed through the rest of this. He is 4 piece deep board. We're not going to look at the artifact stats anymore. <laughs> uh, C0, nothing leveled up. Okay. Mona could be level 70, but as I said, I'm saving these up for Tartaglia. She's got level 70 Makamea. Her artifacts are Emblem of Severed Fate, which is my favorite. My favorite artifact. And... I actually, I actually leveled these up. Oh. Wow, that's uh, that's really surprising. Um, absolutely nothing leveled up here. Gotcha. Okay, we have Diluke, and he's cool. He's got level 70 prototype archaic, and like this weapon looks so cool on him. He has four piece gladiator, which I think his best artifact is Crimson Witch. But I don't like the Crimson Witch domain, and I never get the stuff I need from that domain. It's only that domain. Um, yep. So I guess I'll just show the rest of my characters. I have every 5 star... Is there a skull on that? Looks like two eyes, I don't know what Um... I have every 4 star except Goro. Also this this sword looks really cool on the Angel Traveler. But I have every... so is this sword. Okay, I kinda just give characters weapons I think look cool on them, but anyway. 
I have every four star except Sing Chu and Goro. And I think Goro would be pretty good. Also, I have this um, five star oh, spear. I think Goro might be pretty good. But I really, really want Sing Chu. He's so cute. And I think he's really good. And I really wanted him. And I never got him in the banner he was in. Which makes me very sad. Um, oh yeah, I got this spear from the event. That's R5. So... Yeah. This sword is from PlayStation. And I think it looks really cool. Um, also, yeah. So on Kaya, I have Tartaglia's artifacts. And I think I got pretty lucky. So we have crit damage on this. Hydro damage bonus on this. And I might change the rest of these up, but... This is... Okay. That's pretty good. So... Um, yeah. We have Dory. Well, I just didn't bother give her a weapon at all. I have Kudusara with this bow, and I really like this bow as well. And uh, Lisa, Candice, Zingian, and Amber. Um, I'm not really sure if there's like that much to look over. Um, hmm. I think that's really it I can look over. But, but um, that's um, that's the um, the account. Um, I'm just there's nothing there's nothing really else we can look over. I guess I can say where I am in the story. So I finished. I finished up to Sumeru. Um, I don't have every domain and stuff, as you can see there's a lot of domains I'm missing, but I've gotten up to this part of the story, so I've beaten, I've beaten Skarmouche, which is cool, and I have, I think, all the unlockable areas so far, um, yeah. Uh, I guess that's really it. I guess I have to get an expedition reward, so we'll do that really quickly. But um, yeah, that's the um, that's the account. I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know if I'm gonna edit this down at all. I might just like leave it unedited. And in case you can't tell, this is unscripted because obviously it is like. Like, <laughs> I was probably stuttering so much. But anyway, that's it. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. Um, goodbye.